guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we will be drawing a dog, a greyhound to be specific, because I love dogs. I love greyhounds, and who doesn't? And everyone should love greyhounds, they're the fourth most fastest animal in the world, and racehound stadiums, I don't really like, because after the animal can no longer race, or hurts itself running, it has a 98% chance of getting shot. Although some stadiums do not hurt the animal, they give it to retired uh greyhound trust and look up that website because if a human broke its leg you wouldn't just like shoot it or discipline it so why should you do the same to a dog they're our best friends so as you can see you already draw your circle and, and then you draw another like circle flat circle underneath that so then you're just gonna go back over that circle make it a tiny bit darker i'm gonna make it a tiny bit darker because you can't really see it in my camera so then what you do is you're going to draw an ear at the very like corner of the circle. So you just draw like a line down and a line back up. Kind of, yeah, that's it. So then you draw a line down past along for the neck, down along the other circle, down the back. So as you can see, like so. So then what you do then is, as you can see, it's starting to look like greyhounds now. And there's my dog barking in the background. Don't think you can hear him. So there he is. So then you draw a line from the ear along the top of the circle. And this is going to be the dog's face. So then you draw a line out for the dog's snout. Like, kind of rounds. And then you bring it in. And you can see it's starting to look like a greyhound already. So I'm just going to fix it up there. So then what we're going to do is we're going to draw a line down along for the chest. This is going to be a bit difficult as some drawers find it difficult. So you draw your line down and I'm just going to fix that there because I made a mistake and I hate making mistakes. So, but I have a mistake. So then you draw along but make sure you draw very lightly around like where it go, kind of goes in. So you can draw the leg which is the part that I'm drawing right now. So then you bring it down, uh, this is going to be kind of like kind of like his elbow. So then you bring down your chest, like, yeah. And then you draw another line beside the chest of the dog, and that will look like two legs. So then you draw the dog's nose. That shouldn't be too hard, because it's just like a line, kind of. Then you draw the mouth, and that's a bit difficult too, but you just draw a, sm a little smile, and then you draw a little line going through at the top. So then you draw the eye. Any eye will do because it's your drawing. And I'm just going to draw on these eyes because it looks fun and bouncy. So it looks excited. So then we're just going to fix the ear because it looks a bit down. So then you draw the hip. And the hip is, well, kind of the most important part. And some people don't draw the hip because it looks very weird on the dog. But if I bend my arm right now, my elbow will stick out. So that's the same with the dog's leg. But the hip sticks out instead. So then you're going to draw the dog's tail and some people some people don't really find the dog's tail hard but there it is there. So yeah, so there's your finished dog and I'll see you next week artists. Bye for now. Hey.